Golf is a global game, so it only makes sense that the PGA Tour went from Sea Island, Georgia last week to Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia this week for the CIMB Classic. It's a strong international field, and remember, this is a full-fledged PGA Tour event, so a win here means a lot to those searching to get into the elite tournaments or to solidify their status. A great example of this is our overnight leader, Ricard Carlberg, who carded a bogey-free 7 under 65 to take the lead by two heading into Friday. In addition to his closing birdies on 17 and 18, take a look at this scorecard. The Swede went five under on his front nine. I'd call that a solid day of work. Last week's host of the McGladrey Classic, Davis Love III, had a solid day, including this 21-footer for Eagle on the 10th. He enters Friday at four under par. Now, Love wasn't the only one dropping bombs on Thursday. Ryu Ishikawa made this 34-footer for birdie on the last to finish at three under on the day. Also at three under, other than my fantasy pick this week, Sergio Garcia, that is, it's Matt Every who chipped in for birdie on 13. And let me officially welcome back in his first PGA Tour start since the 2014 PGA Championship where he WD'd with a neck injury, Mr. Jason Duffner. The Duff, who had dropped a few LBs since his last PGA Tour start, stayed active during the rain delay on Thursday, playing an intense game of ping pong with Matt Every and even trying his hand at some bowling. Yeah, these guys do not have a bad locker room set up to retreat to this week. All right, that'll do it from day one at the CIMB Classic, but meet me right back here Friday morning for all the highlights and stories you might have missed, you know, when you were sleeping.